we got back on the gravel and set off for the last stage of the course. Look at that, 50 miles an hour. You're barely aware of it, are you? 50 miles an hour? I know, on rough ground. A little bit of splash. Yeah! Whoa! They're just so capable, aren't they? It's outrageous how good <laughs> it is. But if you are an engineer at Land Rover and you're putting in the long hours developing stuff and you're thinking, you're never going to get used. I know. It's crazy. It's like your rich barrel of humour. You only give us a little bit of it. <laughs> Most of it's just not necessary. <laughs> oh, dear, dear, dear. Whether it ever gets used or not, though, the truth is the Range Rover had cleared every hurdle we'd thrown at it. And with one last obstacle to conquer, the time had come to take back the reins. Now, Luke, you've done the lion's share of the driving. I don't think you fully appreciate everything about this motor. Now, I'm saying get yourself in business class. I'll leave this bit to McGinty. Let's go. Come on. Who's McGinty? That is me. You've been grafting, though. Time for you to relax in business class, my oh. friend. Oh, yes. Right. Oh, it's good to be back. Here we go. Oh, this is steep. Oh, don't worry about that. Oh, you're having a laugh, Paddy. Have you seen this? Look at this, look at this, look at this. Uh, I'm a bit preoccupied at the minute. Oh, you just keep off-roading. I've, I've got a screen. Oh, my word. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Look at that. Electric cup holders. Roll up your tights, madam. We're going in. Hey! Whoa! 